Hello everyone. In this video, I am demonstrating a simple method to create video from a PowerPoint presentation. For that, first we will add audio to a PowerPoint. Then we will convert audio added PowerPoint to a video file. You take a menu options and come to slideshow option. Slideshow option, you can choose record slideshow where you can see two options. In that, you choose record from beginning. You will click that. You will, you will get another pop-up window. You click that, start recording. Now, first slide is getting recorded. The audio in the first slide is getting recorded. So, whatever, whatever I am speaking is getting recorded. If you can stop it in between and you can resume, then it will, the audio is getting recorded. Okay. So, if you want to move to the next slide, a simple procedure. You just press the next button in your keyboard. This will move to the next slide. And you can see in the left corner, the total timing as well as the timing of the second slide. So, which means the audio in the second slide is getting recorded now if you if you press an escape button or if you press a, a next key button it will come back to this view where you can see in the bottom you are, there is a loudspeaker symbol in both slides which means your audio got recorded successfully so that is an indication this loud loudspeaker is an indication that your audio got recorded assume that you made a mistake Suppose you made a mistake in your uh, recording. Suppose you made a mistake in your second slide. You can clear the content where you can two options there. You can you have to clear the timing of the current slide as well as you have to clear the narration. You have to do both. You have to do the timing as well as the narration. If you only if you are only clearing the narration when you do the second time, the timing will be fixed there. So you have to clear the timing as well as the narration has to clear. So I have, first I have clear the timing. Now I am coming to clear the narration. Now I am clearing the narration. Now see the loudspeaker now loudspeaker symbol has gone. Okay. So now the content, the audio from the second PPT, second slide got removed. Now I am re-recording re it. I am doing it again. The same procedure. In the left corner, you can see the total timing as well as the timing of the second slide. Uh, recording timing of second slide now i uh, are done with the total timing in first slide uh, 16 second and second slide 10 second audio got recorded now it become a audio added ppt if you play from play in a uh, what do you call a slideshow mode this will get uh, play as a audio recorded ppt now my audio is mute here so that is why you are not able to hear anything but if you normally play in a slideshow this ppt will work as a audio um, audio added PPT or you can when you play PPT you will you can listen you can hear the uh, audio as well so this is a simple procedure to add audio to a uh, OPA, add audio to a PowerPoint slideshow come to slideshow option again record option add audio now how will you convert that into a video okay you come to file option where you can come to save as option uh, save as option I am demonstrating how you can convert that audio PPT into a video you come to save as option where you can a lot of different versions different versions you can see different formats you can see where you can see you can choose windows media video that format you can choose so here i have chosen windows media video format in a latest powerpoint uh, powerpoint in latest version of powerpoint you can directly export that into mp4 video the, my, i am right now what i am demonstrating is with a older version of powerpoint which 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 uh, does not have a, a MP, direct conversion to mp4 you can convert only with a dot wmb file but in the latest version you can convert that into mp4 file directly convert or export in the export option you can use now see if the file you can is, is getting recorded and it is is this particular dot mp file got saved in this particular folder so this is the simple method to record audio to your powerpoint or add audio to your powerpoint as well as convert that into a video file